Hi, in this video we're going to go over um, how to set up user groups for the NICE memberships. Uh, the NICE memberships sells uh, enrollment to user groups and it uses Joomla ACL or Joomla's core user management system. Uh, it does not create its own user group so it's, it's very integrated into the Joomla system. Now um, by default on installation we, we set up this test membership for you so you have something to look at when you first first start using the NICE membership and something to reference. And you can see here that we've uh, set it up to uh, sell uh, enrollment to the author group, which is a, a base Joomla user group that's automatically installed with all Joomla installations. Um, real quick, we're going to click into here to test memberships. And you can see here's all the membership details. And down here you can see where we've selected author as the uh, subscription group. Um, now, in here, you can also select multiple groups to uh, sell enrollment to with the single membership. Um, but we're not going to do that right now because I'm assuming that most of you want to set up your own user groups for enrollment. Now, with um, Joomla 1.6 and 1.7, Joomla has made significant strides in their, their user groups and they have allowed quite a bit of customization. What we're going to do is we're going to kind of come over here to groups and you can see all of our current groups and we're going to create two new groups. We're going to create one for membership A and one for membership B. So we just click new and we're going to give it a title membership A and save and close. Actually we're going to go Save a new and membership B and save and close. And you can see we've got our two new memberships here under public. So from there, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to set some access levels for those two groups. Now you might be wondering what access levels are, and I'll show you what those are right here. I'm just going to toggle over to a new article uh, window that I opened up. And here you can see this, this parameter that says access. And right now it's uh, this article would be accessible to the general public. Uh, you can also select registered, special, or custom level. Uh, we're going to make a new access level for each one of our membership uh, groups. So we'll toggle back to our uh, membership uh, I mean, sorry, our user uh, manager, and we'll come here to access level and add new access level. Now, for simplicity, we're just going to go ahead and name these something very similar to our group. So we've got membership A access, and I'm going to check membership A, saying membership A has uses membership A access, and I'm going to say save and new, and then I'm going to do one for membership B. Membership B access, and we'll give membership B act the association and save and close. So now we can see we got two new access levels. If I go over to my article, and I'm going to actually say, um, and I'm going to refresh the page, and here we got access again, and we're going to come here and you see membership A and membership B. So I can set this article to be accessible only to uh, user groups that have an access level of membership A. And that way I can I can restrict who sees this article. So that's that's pretty much the long and the short. We're going to go toggle back over to our component real quick. And there's our test membership and we'll click into it and we'll come back down here to subscribes to groups and we're going to change this to membership A. So this membership, test membership, sells enrollment now to membership A. And we'll come up here and say save and close. And you can see, there we go, membership A. All right, great. Well, we'll have some more videos coming up showing you some more stuff about the NICE membership extension for Joomla.